got in the blind this morning. Got Babbo back here. And um, it's opening day of regular season. Maddie killed one youth weekend. So um, hopefully we can get him one and then maybe I can get one. So cross your fingers. Good luck.
the left. come in and they come hammering the decoys um, dad picked out the biggest one what he thought was the biggest and um, put a 
pretty good hit on him. He ran about 10 yards and laid down. Well, I tried to get <clears throat> the crossbow cocked and everything to get a second bird double up. Well, three jakes come in, and I don't know if the three jakes ran him off or what, but they jumped Dad's bird up. They went into the weeds. So we was giving him time. Well, about that time, a single big one come out. So I got in position and got ready. And three, then same three jakes ran him off. Well, then another small jake come in and got on the decoys. Well, then the dom got mad, so hit come in. I ranged him at 32 yards and put a smoking hit on him. So we're going to wait a few minutes and go in and see if we can't recover dad's and mine. So keep your fingers crossed. Them dead ringer broadheads do some damage, so they should be laying over there dead. But we're not going to... We're not going to push them. We're going to give them some time. So. We'll give it a few minutes. Um, we got out of the blind, and we're going to go out to where the decoy is. We're at the exact same spot where Maddie shot hers last, this past weekend. So, actually, Dad's turkey went pretty much right in where she did. We're going to go look for his first. I'll be behind the camera, let Papo track his, and then we'll go try to find mine. So, hopefully we can get this. Hopefully we can find him. where the birds were, Dad. Yeah. Where the decoy was and we'll see if there's any feathers. Dad just had knee surgery not a month ago. So he's kind of wobbly. So look at feathers. Got a bunch of feathers. Yeah. Where'd it go in at? Huh? Right here. Was it there or to the No. To be honest with you, to the right, I thought. I thought he went in right in there. But maybe not, I don't know. Yeah, here for you. Oh, there's feathers, yeah. Yeah, so he went in right here. That's where the other two chased him. Huh? There he is. I didn't think he went too far. Because he was hurting. Oh heck. It's a good bird. Single beard. Beard. Pretty good set of spurs. Well, Dad found his, so I'm gonna go try to find mine now. Hopefully, <coughs> Dad can keep me in focus and keep me in the frame. Mine went in right up here, did Yeah. This has been one of my most exciting hunts. I um, found my turkey, 
I kind of thought we would with the way we hit them. We're going to go back out. We're going to put turkeys next to the decoy and we'll do our post interview. Oh, that's a heavy bird. Wow. This has kind of been a, a goal of mine is <coughs> to tag out with Papaw in the same blind. We tagged out a few years ago on the same day, but I had to use my gun and because um, I hurt my hand and he used a crossbow. But, um, you know, Dad's taught me a lot when it comes to hunting and everything, and he's given me the chance to introduce my daughter to the outdoors. And this has just been... I know Papal didn't want to shoot a bird, but um, this is pretty exciting for me. You know, Maddie shot hers Saturday, and me and Dad got ours today. And the only thing that could have been any better was Maddie being here, but for some reason, Indiana opens their turkey season on Wednesdays. So um, we're going to run these up. Maddie's going to get out of school, and we're going to get pictures with him. The old scorpion crossbow did the job with the dead ringer broadheads, and like I said, this has been a, a hunt come true right here. So the DS decoys did their job, and um, pretty exciting. We didn't think it was going to happen because all the other shooting going around, but um, we got it done. So now we're going to lay off the turkeys and let this be a sanctuary. So, thanks, Dad. There I was. Back in the wild again And I felt right at home Where I belong